The NAMFA National Conference is the largest conference that NAMFA does during the year. I've often heard members after they leave the conference that they bring back some tidbits of information that they can use in their practices. Most um, I've heard often about how to do marketing, how to use the finance advisor, they might learn a new piece of CRM software, or just something that they can use for the staff to We're starting off with uh, Doug Lip, who worked for Disney, and he, he's got this insight from behind the scenes of this major corporation and how to uh, help in his role was with with customers and to make them just feel uh, the best they can. I have insights from Washington again with David Gergen. The team decided to bring him back. He spoke at NAPFA uh, two years ago. Uh, in the Northeast, uh, and actually in Orlando, and he was very well received. Ed Klontz, who spoke uh, in 2010, is coming back again to give a keynote. Lee McDar, who uh, folks may or may not know, has um, has a skill in being able to talk about resiliency in today's world, and she's. For the first time ever, NAFA is creating a mobile web application called Trip Builder. So you'll be able to download it to your iPhone or any kind of smartphone that you have, and you'll be able to get all the latest uh, conference happenings. You'll be able to know the exhibitors, the sessions, if something's been changed. We'll be able to do surveys, your CEs, all kinds of good stuff. I can't say enough about this hotel. It is uh, absolutely beautiful. The, uh, the, the setting is beautiful, the gardens are beautiful, this is going to be spring when everyone is there, so hopefully the weather is going to be conducive to our being, you know, members walking outside into this courtyard, beautiful fountains. Early bird deadline ends April 20th. Uh, if you register after that, it'll be $7.95, but if you take advantage of the early bird, it's $100 off, it's $695. So I encourage you to go online and register today. Over the last couple of years, we've heard that with the market downturns and the tightening of dollars, that everybody's been, you know, tightening their belt straps and not wanting to travel or go to conferences. But it's imperative that you continue your financial planning education. This is where it happens.